holding a teddy. What's the teddy for? It's parachuting teddies. He's a bit nervous though, he doesn't like heights. <laughs> Now, could you explain to me what the Teddy Initiative is all about? Well, it's just really to show the children that church can be fun and uh, to come inside the building that they perhaps don't come into it another time and to bring something that they love, which gives them confidence. And is it also a form of outreach to the wider community? Yes, yes. And how will it achieve that? Well, because it's open to anybody and hopefully more people will arrive as time goes on. Before, we've had a lot of people, holiday makers as well, and they come to think of Dalton as a good place to be. And what do you think of the Pope's visit to Britain this week? I'm quite happy for the Pope to come to Britain. He's got his followers and uh, it's nice for them to meet him. I think it'll be good for like people around because they'll have a different opportunity of seeing other things rather than just all the stuff that's around originally. They'll have a new opportunity to meet another person and get to know him and about his job. Well I was actually born in Dalverton so I guess probably all my life really. But um... Do you feel the Pope's visit is important to you? Um, probably not, no. I don't think it really makes any difference to me whatsoever. Him. <laughs> It's a wonderful thing for him to come to our country and I would love to see him. Are you going to be able to get along? No. And you were christened a Catholic? Yes. And what do you think the Pope has to offer? Why wonderful? I just think it's lovely for him to come to our country. I'd rather see him at the Vatican than here, if I'm honest. But I just think, yeah, no, I think it's just a wonderful spiritual thing for him to come to our country. <laughs> So is this the first teddy going over the top? This is the first teddy. Yes. Whose teddy is this? This is Angus's teddy. No, I just know who it is. It's my boss. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> I think he can show us that he, he does re um, unite the world together and um, people think he's distant but he isn't if he, cause he does travel to so many places and uh, I think that's a good one for everything, you know. Um. Ten, And do you feel that he could potentially bring a changing message of global peace and justice and tolerance? I'd imagine he can influence that. Um, you know, he can certainly have an opinion on it. Um, it it's, you know, how much people take notice of, of um, his word, I guess. It's very exciting that he's coming, but um, it does seem to be an incredible amount of money to have to spend on the visit. But I think it's lovely for the Catholics over here. And I, you know, we're all very pleased, I think, that he is. I'm not particularly happy about it. I mean, he's, he's welcome to come. Of course he is. Uh, but uh, I'd just like him to show a bit more humility, really. It seems to me that uh, that's been like the thing that's been lacking. And in what areas? Well, about the, the child protection issues, the child abuse, uh, uh, I think we need a little bit more than just I'm sorry. I think we actually need to look at the fundamental things about the way that the Catholic Church trains its priests, um, the way that it brings up young men apart from women and apart from other um, ordinary people who might perhaps give them a broader perspective on life. I hope it will bring uh, refreshment and renewal and encouragement uh, in the conversation and the common search for, for unity. Now, people say that now is an ecumenical winter. Would you agree with that? Um, no, but I would agree it's, um, it's, it's uh, 
not the most um, promising of uh, summer, Simon. This November we are seeing the 50th anniversary of the Pontifical Council for Christian Unity and the Archbishop of Canterbury is going over to deliver a paper. Is that archic getting back on the road again? It is. It is. Um, it was agreed last year between the Pope and the Archbishop that Archic Three would be formed, and uh, the Anglican uh, team is pretty much together, and we're waiting for the Roman Catholic team to be signed off, and uh, then it will get started. Are you excited by the Pope's visit? Yeah, I think it's a very exciting um, initiative. But unity in our lifetimes, possibility? Um, I'm not a prophet, nor a prophet's son. Thank <laughs> you.